Hey folks, welcome back. Today we're going to be going over a quick functional drawing of the layers of the perineum. Now the perineum is of course the underside, the inferior aspect of the human trunk between the coccyx and the pubic symphysis. Now imagine this is the pelvic cavity. Its lowermost boundary is called the pelvic floor, made of course of the levator ani and coccygeus muscles. Everything below this floor is the perineum. Now apart from the skin, the perineum is sealed off from the outside world by a layer of superficial fascia, which itself has a superficial and a deep aspect. The superficial layer is typically fatty, and the deep layer is membranous and sometimes known as collis fascia. Within the perineum, we have a perineal membrane that separates the perineum into two cavities, the deep and superficial pouch. The deep pouch is going to contain the deeper transverse perineal muscles. If you ever hear the term urogenital diaphragm, that is referring to the muscles and associated fascia within this pouch. The superficial one is going to contain the roots of the erectile tissue, the crura and the bulb of the penis or clitoris, as well as our superficial transverse perineal muscles. And that's us. I hope this clears things up for you. See you next time, folks.